Well, well. Well, well, well. If it isn't Ant and Dick. <laughs> welcome, welcome, comedy behemoth. <laughs> or just General Giantman, aren't you getting away with some shite at the moment on the Irish <laughs> Airways? We thought we were swinging it a bit with the panel, but Jesus, lad, you've taken it to an art form. Thank this, you, sir. This parade of... Co- well it's, done. It's I'm disgraceful, isn't it? It's you. disgraceful, isn't it? It's appalling stuff. It's wonderful. You think, <laughs> it's think it's RTE could have come up with something better than cursing fellas. <laughs> I know, yeah. I, man, have you ever taken the heat off us as well? It's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Glory. Yes, 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 yes. Glory. Darren, for a fella from Bray with a disproportionate head, <laughs> right, you've done very well Indeed. Thank you very, very much. You the panel, yeah, of course, yeah. your household name in both Ireland and the UK. Yeah. You've hosted many shows. Haven't I got news for you? The live floor show, the Mock the Week and Turn Back Time. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. How did you break into TV in Britain? I mean, that's the tricky one, isn't it? There, there, that, that is almost... Bet you didn't think we were going to ask you a real question. No, I didn't at all. <laughs> <laughs> There's something wrong here. Oh. This, is like, this is a setup in some way. Uh, you do it... Do you, you do it by no. What? No, no. What? What's wrong with you then? No, wait a minute. No, there's something. No, there's no way that that's actually you actually want to know how do you oh, break you do. into. Oh, do we do? Oh, we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> what you do is obviously you 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 completely fuck with my head now. Yeah. yeah. I thought that might work. Yeah. yeah. The, uh, it's, you, you do gigs, you do the Edinburgh, the road of Edinburgh and from yeah. Edinburgh. Right, we don't really give a shit. Already, <laughs> already, yeah. So, Darren, were you shitting yourself when you were asked to do Have I Got News for You? No, 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 I wasn't shitting myself. Uh, <laughs> I think that, that wouldn't be the way to describe Because we were doing the panel live at that stage. So, well, frankly, it was, in the way you'd put it yourselves, a piece of piss. I, I, that's not the way I normally put it, but fuck it, I'm here. Yeah, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean, I'll go back. The, uh, <laughs> Uh, the, it was actually surprisingly easy in compared to that because they actually give you a load of stuff on an auto queue that you can. Anytime you're talking straight out and something like "Have I got news for you?" You're reading. Oh, oh yeah, so yeah. you're not making it up in your head not, then when you're saying it. No, if you're talking left or right, that's made up, right? Oh, right. If you're talking straight ahead and you see the eyes moving slightly like that, that's all on an auto queue and "Have I got news for you?" Oh, grand so. <laughs> <laughs> Fair play to you, Darren O'Brien. <laughs> Who are Daryl O'Byrne's favourite comedians? <laughs> I can only guess on his behalf. Uh, <laughs> if, if he's anything like me, uh, they'd be uh, Eddie Izzard. Or oh, right, oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very, uh, Rich Hall in America, I don't know if you know. Oh, yeah, uh, right, Bill right. Bailey. Uh, oh, really? Very brilliant as well. At the, uh, there's a load of those lads. Very good. Paul Martin. Yeah. Yeah. Very good, very good. And, yeah. and, 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 and no Brendan Grace. <laughs> <laughs> What? I know he but forgot to say it. That's all. He it, it just about, actually was. He was on on Tuberty, uh, and he was hilarious. He was yeah. brilliant. The, uh, yeah, but when you, when you put him beside Tuberty, it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's not difficult. <laughs> <laughs> You have a DVD yet? I do, yeah, yeah. Well, listen, will, will we show a clip of his new DVD? What oh, do you think? No, you know what? Let's just show another embarrassing clip. <laughs> <laughs> I think that'll be more fun. Yeah. <laughs> right, the finest in entertainment from Galway. <laughs> That's what they love out west. You'll also be seeing three families fighting for a brand new car. <laughs> But only, they only get that car if they manage to survive the shredder. <laughs> ah, okay. Back in the days Ooh. when your tie could match your shirt without any embarrassment. Yeah, <laughs> that, that show truly a was family. a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> But only did it for two series. All right. Uh, and then ran away. What? How did you make it after that muck? <laughs> I, I went to England. Uh, I, had to <laughs> I genuinely had to emigrate after that show went out. Yeah. Okay. yeah. I believe you got married. And, and, and you're off living. You're off living in the England now. I am living in the England. I've, I've been living in the England for five years. Uh, are we not good enough for you, talk, no. Darren? Are we not anymore? Yeah, that, that's the way to take look at it. That, that I have somebody insulted you. Oh right? yeah. Oh yeah. 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 When oh, I was living here, I was presenting shows with a giant shredding robot. <laughs> Why do you true, think I emigrated true. to England? No one has offered me a job involving a shredder at any stage during my career, and nor will they. Again. You do realise, though, that if you have kids in England, they are going to call you Darren. I don't want to go to bed, Darren! I don't want to go to bed, Darren! Clean up yourself, you bony bastard! What's going to happen? What's going to happen to you? Let me see how 
God, why did we raise them up here? Aren't they all spoiled and gay? I will, <laughs> and I will love my little English children. <laughs> well, listen, fair play to you, Dara O'Brien. Good man yourself. We they, gave you there, you said your name correctly there. And it was, was a sweet, kind gift from you. After Wasn't we it? put you on your show, and then you reward us by getting a show that gets 100,000 more viewers than we do. <laughs> In fairness, 250,000 more than you. <laughs>